Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Tuesday. It's my day off. <clears throat> I dropped the kids off at daycare this morning and then I went to Walmart and I just stopped at Arby's to get some lunch because I'm starving. The lady that I work for got a wrap from Arby's a few days ago and it was so good that I went and got one. <laughs> and now I just went and got another one today for lunch because it's just, they're so good. But when I was at um, Walmart today, I bought like this spinach and herb wrap and I got a rotisserie chicken and some lettuce and stuff. I'm going to try to recreate my own wrap for like lunch tomorrow <coughs> yeah I want to start getting into salads too I need to look up different like types of ways to make salads to eat for lunch and dinner and stuff I really need to change the way I eat I know I do you guys are always calling me out on it and making me feel like poop but it's not an easy it's not an easy change to make you know what I mean? I'm on my way home. I got some stuff for the kids to eat. I got a lot of like snacks and garbage. <sighs> I don't know why. I was thinking about the kids and I was thinking about stuff to pack and the lunch boxes and stuff. And so I got like cookies and like pop tarts and like all this junk. Anyways, it is what it is. Um, Oh, and then I got the kids, I think I got Esri two more outfits and a pair of pajamas. Kids needs clothes, so that's why you guys keep seeing me buy clothes. Like, the kids need clothes for summer. I think they're good now, though. I, I, I think they're good. I don't know. I still have more time to get them more if they need it. But I think for, like, the beginning of, like, spring and summer, I think they're good for clothes. Yulela's dad did give me um, some money. He sent it through Western Union. And uh, it's the first time he gave me money in a really long time. So he gave me 200 And so I grabbed her two pair of sandals. And I got her some shorts. But I think I might end up taking them back. go home and I'm gonna eat and I'm gonna edit my next vlog and then I'm gonna clean up the house until it's time to go get the kids I really want to get my house done I was gonna try to sell stuff around the house but honestly I just want to donate it and get it out of the way like I really want to do this whole um, you know living with less minimalist type of lifestyle it's just hard for me to do with the kids because i don't want to like force the kids to live with less because i want to but like i just need to get rid of all the extra stuff in the house that we really don't need like i really want to do that <sighs> like a few days ago or no was it last week i donated like three boxes of stuff and like an old stroller that somebody gave me which i probably could have sold but i don't know i just I was cleaning out the shed trying to make room for the kids' pool that I got them for Easter pools. And I just like took everything out of that shed and I just like donated like pretty much all of it except for Yulela's bike and like my Christmas decorations and like like holiday decorations. That was pretty much it that, that, I, that I kept. So my like little storage area is all clean which is nice. Took me all day to do that shit though. All right, I'm home, so I'll see you guys when I get in the house. I gotta take all the stuff in the house. All right, so I'm home. What time is it? 11.15, so I still got like three hours before I go get the kids. I can get stuff done in three hours. Your Lilo's probably gonna wanna play outside. She's been driving me crazy with this. I wanna play outside, I wanna play outside. Ever since it got warm. But I'll show you my haul real quick. 
Alright, so this is what I got Ulayla. I'll show you a little Ulayla stuff first. So I got her these cute little slides. Aren't they cute? I hope she likes them. She didn't like those pink ones that I got her in the last haul, so I'm probably going to return those. And I hope she likes these ones. They're cute and they're white, so they'll go with pretty much everything. And then I saw these um, brown sandals that... I thought were cute and hopefully she likes them too. I just want her to have like a couple pairs of sandals so she's not like in sneakers all summer. So this will give her three pairs of sandals because I got her those black ones from Once Upon a Child too, remember? So she's got black, white, and she's got brown sneakers or brown sandals. So I think she's good for sandals. Um, I got her some new socks because I got her like a five pack, maybe it was a five or a six pack of socks. And I was like, let me get her some more socks because whenever she goes to her dad's, she tends to wear her socks and then she comes back in like socks that are way too small for her feet. Like, I don't understand. He needs to go buy her some bigger socks because <laughs> the socks that she comes home in, I always end up just like getting rid of them because they're so small, they barely stay on her feet. So, um, I go through socks because like I said, when she goes back to her dad's, she wears a pair of socks and then they're at his house and then I get a pair that I can't use. <laughs> but how many is this? This is 10 pairs. So this, this hopefully should last, you know, all summer because these are kind of thin. I wanted some thin socks for the summer in case she does ever wear some sneakers. Um, I got her these shorts. Because I'm trying to find something to go with her Nike shirt. Which I brought it downstairs to show you. You guys remember I got this Nike shirt for Once Upon a Child. And I thought while I was at Walmart that these shorts would go cute with it. But I'm not convinced. I don't know. What do you guys think? I feel like the white kind of... I don't know. I guess there's white in this too. I'm going to have her try it on and see what it looks like. I also got a black pair, which I think I might like better with the Nike shirt. I don't know. But I'll probably end up returning it because I need to return these because I got her these. I also got her this Under Armour shirt from Once Upon a Child, and I don't have any pants for her to wear. So I grabbed a couple of purple options. But the purple is off. Like, I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> uh, so, I'm going to return those. And then I bought these. Thinking maybe she could wear these with the Nike shirt. But again, the purple is not the same color. And I have to remember dark purple, not light purple. So these are going to get returned. I don't know. These pants are really soft inside, but I feel like summer's coming, so she really doesn't need more pants. You know what I mean? So I'll probably return those. Probably return one or two of these shorts. I don't know. Maybe these do kind of go with it. What do you guys think? I'll have her try them on. So that's your Layla's stuff. Let me show you Ezzy's. All right, so here's Ezzy's stuff that I got him. I picked up this Coco Melon doll. It's a nighttime, a bedtime JJ doll, and it sings. Ezri loves Coco Melon. <sighs> My plan was to get it, and I'm gonna save it for Christmas this year. Um, it's already April. Like, huh? Oh. <laughs> gonna save it for Christmas. This doll, I have not seen this doll on the shelf since before Christmas. It's so hard to find these, and there's only one there at Walmart on the shelf. So I snatched it up and I grabbed it, and I'm like, ooh. <laughs> so I got it. And then um, there's like two other things I want to get them for Christmas from Walmart. I want to get them and put them away. <clears throat> and then I picked him up some more summer sandals. I'm trying to find some sandals to fit this kid. The other pair of sandals that I bought him, I ended up having to return because his, well, I didn't return them yet, but I have them in the bag ready to be returned. Um, because his feet are too skinny. Like, 
this boy wears a size three in shoes, and a size three in sh in these shoes are for six months old. Look, size three to four is for a six month old. He should be wearing size four and five right now. Like that's crazy. He's just he's so small. But I got him those. I thought these would be really like perfect for when he's outside playing with the water table. So he doesn't get like his good sneakers wet. Or he can just wear these, you know, when it's hot out. If he feel if he still fits them once, I'm sure he will. Um, I got him some navy blue shorts, just because I have a shirt upstairs that he needs like some shorts or pants to go with that shirt. So got that. And then I picked him up this really cute outfit. It's a onesie. A onesie. Well, is that a dinosaur or an alligator? Dinosaur. Of course it's a dinosaur. <laughs> with these dinosaur shorts. And then I also picked up the like really super thin pants that match that onesie too. Just in case I want to put pants on them instead of shorts. <clears throat> I just thought that was super cute. And then I got him a Spider-Man outfit. And then I got him a pajama because he does need pajamas that are not long sleeve. But I got it 18 months in this pajama because I feel like this Wonder Nation brand, like their pajamas, they, I don't know, they, they like seem to run like tight for some reason because he has 12 month like long sleeve pajamas like this, but it's like as soon as you wash them and dry them, they look super tight to me for some reason. But if he doesn't fit this, I will save this for when he does. Eventually he will fit this size, but I think this is going to be all right. Like I said, they run small. All right, so next, I actually went to the store and bought myself something. I got myself some socks. These are just like some thinner socks than what I wear now. And uh, they're supposed to be moisture. Uh, what's it called? Moisture control. So I got those. And then I picked myself up a pajama because I wanted some more pajamas. So this is just like a tank top the best is yet to come and then here are some little sleep shorts I don't know how this is gonna fit I may end up returning it but I'm gonna try it on and let's see and then I also picked up this little scrubber because I want to scrub the floor you guys remember in my other vlog um, I have like this like really dirty sticky crappy stuff on my floor from the carpet from you know laying the carpet down probably wet after mopping and so I need to scrub it up. I bought some Goo Gone a while ago and I haven't used it yet because I needed to buy a scrubber. So now I have a scrubber and I'm gonna try to scrub it up. It's like, hold on. See, it's like right here too. Hopefully I can get it up. And then I bought these. I bought this plug-in to go in the bathroom. I never use these, but I was like, let me try it for the bathroom. And then I bought refills. There we go. It wasn't focused. And then I bought this for the house. I noticed we are getting black ants. I've seen a few black ants in the house. And I use this every year. I spray our house with this in the summertime. And it's really good with keeping spiders and ants out. I don't know about the roach thing because we don't have roaches here. But it's really good with keeping the spiders out and the ants all summer. And you only got to spray once. All right, let me show you what I got for food. All right, so this is the garbage that I got. You got, I told you guys I got garbage. I saw these and I thought of the kids because this morning they didn't have time to have breakfast. So they both ate a pack of... Uh, muffins in the car on the way to daycare for breakfast um but i thought they might like these in the morning for breakfast little donut bites and little blueberry donut thingy and then i got myself these i know i know i'm diabetic i shouldn't be eating this but i really like these with my coffee sean got me liking those i don't buy them often but 
I was in the aisle looking at this stuff and I saw those and I was like, hmm, haven't had them in a while. Then I got these, just another option for the kids in the morning. Set of pop tarts. These are pop tart bites. I think they will be easier for like Ez to eat and uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if the kids are going to eat them. This is like new stuff. I never bought the kids that I don't know that they're going to eat, but we'll see. And I saw these. Me and you Layla love carrot cake. We love carrot cake. And they have carrot cake Oreo cookies. I had to try them. I think I had these before, though. I don't know. But they... <laughs> we love carrot cake. And then these cookies were by the Oreos. And I've never seen these before. And I wanted to try them all, so... They had, oh no, they had a chocolate chip one too, but I didn't get that one. I just wanted these ones. So this is butterscotch and chocolate chip. This is peanut butter with chocolate drizzle. And then this is uh, confetti. And they're soft cookies. And I thought it is when I saw this. Easy cookies for him to eat. And you, Layla, I figured I can pack like one or two in her lunchbox as like a snack to go with her sandwich. So that's the junk food part of the grocery haul. Okay, this is the last of it. Groceries. I got some bread that I accidentally smashed. I swear, every time I buy bread, I always end up smashing at least one part of the freaking loaf. I swear. Got some coffee. Um, got some chicken fried rice. Some long grain and wild rice. Always buy this when I make stuffed peppers. And I bought some red peppers to stuff. I got some, oh, just a little thing of broccoli, just because when I make this sunflower seed crunch salad, I like to put broccoli in it. Got some ketchup, because Lila uses ketchup like crazy. Um, got some carrots, because I got a roast, and I'm going to make that tomorrow. Since I work 10 hours tomorrow, I'm going to throw this baby in a crock pot in the morning and let it cook while I'm at work all day come home and dinner will be ready plus you Layla likes carrots and uh and ranch so she can have I'll save some of those for her for lunch tomorrow carrots and ranch and then she's obsessed with peanut butter sandwiches no jelly that's what she eats takes the daycare every day for her lunch um but I bought some crunchy peanut butter to see if she would like that she, I don't think she's ever tried it before I used to love crunchy peanut butter when I was little and I got some honey Dijon dressing, calorie free. Look at no carbs. Aren't you guys proud? <laughs> and I bought that to go with these wraps. So I'm gonna make wraps with the uh, rotisserie chicken that I got. And I also got like some um, deli meat in the fridge I can use for this too. But here's the lettuce that I got. Got some green leaf lettuce to put in the wrap and some tomatoes. And then I got my honey Dijon dressing. Got a rotisserie chicken I'm going to chop up for the wraps. And then I also got this salad. I really like this salad. I want to like recreate this. Sweet onion vinaigrette though. I don't know where I would even find that dressing. The dressing is really good. And I really like the cranberries and walnuts mix in with this salad. It tastes really good with this dressing. Maybe I can try to like make the dressing on my own. Um, and then I picked this up. I like to go through the seasoning aisle just to see what they have. And this is creamy chicken and vegetable like seasoning packet. I already have some chicken in the freezer so I'm going to try to make this someday. I think I'm going to make it with spinach. That will be the veggie because I have some spinach, some frozen spinach. Hmm, I don't know. We'll see. It might be good. Alright, so that's what I got for food. Alright, now that the grocery haul is out of the way, I probably could have put that in a separate video, but I'm not. I don't think I'm going to vlog that much today. I'm gonna sit down and eat my lunch now. It's probably all cold. I'm gonna sit down and eat my lunch and edit a video. And then when I'm done, I'm gonna go put those groceries away. 
All right, so groceries are put away. I'm not going to get done much done. <laughs> Dang, I was really motivated to get some stuff done while the kids are at daycare. <sighs> but it's 1 o'clock now. My video is currently uploading. So later on tonight, I'll uh, title it and all that stuff and write stuff in the description box. And then I'll make it public tomorrow morning. <clears throat> That'll be tomorrow's vlog. Whew. I'm going to take this stuff that I bought upstairs. I definitely want to put Coco Melon away. I don't want Ezzy to see it. I'm trying the new pajamas that I got. I'm going to leave you Layla stuff down here because I want her to try those shoes on and those shorts. <coughs> All right. I'm trying this pajama thing on. I took my bra off because that's how I would wear this without a bra. So I want it to, you know, it's all right. I mean, it's only pajamas. They are soft and they are comfy. I really like the shorts. I'm just not a fan of this shirt, but I don't know. I guess it's so big on the side. I hate that. It smells really good. Hopefully it makes the bathroom smell good. We'll see. That plug-in thing smells so good. <laughs> I got like an hour before I got to get the kids. I mean, they could stay at daycare longer, but I don't like to leave them in there for a long time, especially when I'm like not doing anything and I'm at home, you know. But I decided I'm going to take this pajama back. I just don't like the way it looks on me. It looks sloppy, I guess you could say. <laughs> And I don't want to look sloppy. Whew. Um, so I got like an hour before I got to get the kids. One of the things on my to-do list was to clean out our little shoe area and get rid of shoes we don't wear, shoes that don't fit you, Layla, no more, shoes that I don't wear. Um, I have a box that I'm going to throw that stuff in because I'm starting another pile of like donation stuff. So let me do that before I go get the kids up. At least I can mark that off my list. And it's such a mess in here. <coughs> so yeah, we'll do that. All right, so this right here is uh, what I'm talking about. We're not even supposed to have anything over here. Cause it's like our little like where our furs and hot water and stuff is it's like off to the kitchen and uh but this is where our coats get hung up when we come in and our shoes um but there's a lot of stuff over here i want to get rid of a lot of shoes and yeah all right so i'm gonna grab all these shoes from over here and take them into the living room and then here's the box that I have for the shoes that I'm going to donate and I'm going to put my coat in the closet in the living room because it's too hot to wear that coat now so I'm going to put it away pack it up for next winter yeah all right let's get this little area clean before I get the kids all right so I got this all cleared out I need to sweep it and mop it and uh, get the cobwebs down and spray some of that stuff that I bought today for spiders and ants and stuff in here. But <sighs> yeah, so I just have my diaper bag, one of Eula's sweaters, my sweater that I, I wear almost every day, and then Ezzy's diaper bag. So yeah, I made a pile right here of coats and hats and gloves and stuff that I'm gonna put in a bag. For donation I also have a black jacket that I wore for years that I replaced with the really pretty red one um, that I got recently um, so I'm gonna throw that in the pile as well and 
um, this is a whole box of shoes that I'm going to get rid of. Most of it's your Layla's. There's a few pair of mine in there. And then I got a bunch of sandals down here that I'm going to try to sell. Except for those ones in the back. I like those ones. But these ones, I don't like. <laughs> and I barely wore them because I just found that they were very uncomfortable. So I was going to just donate them, but they're basically brand new. So I'm going to see if I can at least get a couple of dollars for them. You know, if not, then I'll go ahead and throw them in a donation box later on. And then I also found these slides for you, Layla. I wet them because they were like dusty. Um, but I forgot that I bought these for her last summer and they were too big for her. So I saved them and they are her size now. She's a size 13 now. So now she has a pair of black slides. <sighs> so technically, I really didn't have to buy those white ones today because <laughs> I, didn't, I, I didn't even know she had these. But I'm about to go get the kids now because it is 3 o'clock. I wanted to get them at 2.30, but I was just, like, in the groove, like, you know. Not in the groove, but in the... I was focusing on what I was doing here. We're home. You know, Layla tried on her, her stuff, and uh, she liked it. What's the matter? Say hi. <laughs> no? We're outside. Got Ezzy out here. You Layla's riding her bike and playing with some kids in the neighborhood. Look at the flower, Ezzy. Look. Looky. You see it? <laughs> you see it? I brought his house out here so he's got something to play with since he's not walking, like really walking yet. Here comes you, Layla. Look at the rider bike. See the flower? <laughs> I think they're about the roof. guys a playhouse. In jail? Yeah. yeah. Not you again. This is like this is a big playhouse. Great. My the taxes will hurry up and come. I still haven't got my taxes. I think I might get the kids a big house. Look at Ezzy walking. I'm so brave. Look at Ezzy. You see him?
You lay love back down here. I said, come back down this way. You're trying to jump, Ezzy. Cheers at Walmart. I should have bought one. I should get them both on. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. They are definitely getting in the bathtub when we get in the house. Alright, so it is... 544 and I just brought the kids in the house. They're taking a bath because they were like Yolila was rolling around <laughs> in the grass. As he was crawling in the grass and like touching, you know, stuff outside the other kids was touching, like all that stuff. Which is fine, but I just want them to take baths so they're clean. Dang, I look rough. I look like I had a rough long day. <laughs> Uh, anyway, um, I took my hair down when I was outside. I was talking to my neighbor, and she made coffee. We were drinking coffee while our kids were outside playing, and we were talking about plants and stuff because she has a lot of plants in her hey, house. Mom. And I, uh, I want some plants in my house. I just have the one cactus and uh, plant that my mom got me for my birthday last year. And then I have my orchid, which died, but um, well, the leaves died off of it. What are you doing? I got watermelons. But she said that it takes like a year for oh, for it to grow back. But I want to go get another plant for my house. Mama? She was like telling me where to go and stuff. What? On Saturday, um, at my um school, at the building school, on Saturday, they're gonna like um do they're gonna plant trees. Oh, are they? Yeah, so we watched the principal's um video and then that's what he said. We can we can plant something. No, you need to sit down because as he's trying to get up like you are. Sit. As he sit. What? It's like you trained him like a dog. No, he knows what it means to sit down. Sit down. Sit. As he sit. Both the kids are in a bathtub together for the first time. I never let them take a bath together before. I think I'm gonna donate as he's bathtub because He's big enough to go in like the normal tub now and it's just taking up space in the closet. So I think I'm gonna donate his bathtub with the um, with the shoes that I put in my truck earlier when I got the kids, that big old box of shoes. But yeah, they had to get a bath because they were all in the dirt. As he was crawling in the grass, your Layla was like crawling under a fence. Don't do that again. It was fun. Now her white shirt she was wearing is all dirty. Stop bouncing on me! Get off the head! Don't push him. Don't push him. Oh, water! But yeah, I wanted to get them in the bathtub first so they could keep playing. So they were playing outside before I get dinner. I think dinner is just gonna be that rotisserie chicken. Um, and then whatever's left, I'll take it off the bone and put it in a separate like container for, for wraps or something. Be careful, I don't want water all over. 
How does the bathroom smell? Does it smell good? Yeah. I bought one of these pluggy thingies up here. Did you notice it smells good upstairs? You walk up the stairs, you can smell this thing like all over upstairs. As you sit down, I like it. No, no. Don't do that to we me. Have to we have to wash his hair. No, you're going to get water in his eyes. So? I will wash his hair. Do not put water over his head. Hey, guys, this is what I do to me. I'm not vlogging in the bathroom, so I can't. All right, I'm going to wash Ezzy up. I'll take your squeezing. Hey, Layla. And uh, I'll see you guys downstairs. All right, so working on dinner. I got some green beans back there. Got some rice cooking. And I'm warming up the rotisserie chicken. Dang, I need to clean my oven. Um, I'm warming up the rotisserie chicken. I like put a crap load of like butter on it so it doesn't dry out. And dang, I look like crap. I didn't put makeup on today. I should have. I don't like looking at myself without makeup now. I got like in in the routine of wearing makeup and seeing myself with makeup. And now I'm just like, Ugh, when I don't have it on. <laughs> this house is a mess, like always. But at least I got my little closet area cleaned. I'm so glad I did. I'm thinking I might buy, you know those like plastic things that people usually put clothes in like they use them as dressers they have the drawers and it's on the wheels and normally you see like three drawers in it i saw one at walmart today for 20 bucks and i was gonna get it and put it in my upstairs hallway but i think i'm gonna get one and put it over there in the shoe area so that way there'll be one for me one for you layla and one for esri shoes like the shoes that we wear like all the time and it will keep that area from us just throwing shoes over there and it getting messy looking. I think. I'm going to try that. <sighs> um, and I also want to get Ezzy a, a swing. The neighbor has a swing. I didn't vlog it. I should have. The neighbor has one of those little tyke swings. And I was like, can I put my baby in your swing? I want to see if he likes it. And Ezzy was like smiling and laughing and she's like yeah i only got it for like 25 dollars at walmart so and i did see it i saw it today and i should have grabbed it but i think i'm gonna go to walmart thursday today's tuesday i work all day tomorrow unless i go tomorrow probably not and i'm gonna grab one of those swings for ez and then a um one of those tote things for our shoes not tote like drawer things i think it will work i hope it works i need to figure out something to keep that area over there cleaner you know what's your problem oh lord and I'm, hungry. I'm cooking dinner right now would you I like did. would you like a green bean yes <laughs> here you go I swear, if it's not cooked, I'll just... So you're so hungry, so that means when dinner is done, you're going to eat it, right? Because you're so hungry. Mm -hmm. Right? Wait. Well, yeah. As he's playing with the shoes. This dude is obsessed with shoes. He's like over there having the time of his life right now with all those shoes. <laughs> the green means the Yeah. It's almost 630. I'm glad you guys got a bath early. Don't. It's hot. Stop it. Can I grab one? Another? You, Layla, this pan is hot. Stop. You want a piece of Easter candy? Mm -hmm. We need to eat this up. I still got a whole bag down there of eggs we got to open up. Here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I want to sneak the uh -uh -uh. All right, that's it until you eat. No. You about to shoot some hoops? Yay! 
He knows how to put the balls in the basket, but I haven't showed him how to kick it yet, because. <laughs> Stand up with the ball. Yeah, he is. Come here. Mama, help you. Mama, <laughs> turn it down. Fine. Turn it down. Turn it down. Jeez, wheeze. This watermelon, I hope it's sweet. I've had it for like, I don't know, four days maybe. I can never pick a good watermelon. How do you pick a good watermelon? How do you know if it's sweet and good? All last year, every time I bought a watermelon, it wasn't like good. okay it's not like super juicy and sweet but it's okay one piece of watermelon Not that sweet, but sure. Where's, where's it from? Here. Oh no wait. Here, I just bit off of that one. Okay. So don't eat the seeds. Yeah, you can eat the seeds. Yeah, but last time I watched a video, someone ate the seeds. They 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 went down the body and then they turned into a watermelon. You watched a video where someone ate a seed? And they turn into a watermelon. Mm -hmm. Like, like, it was like tree branches, of, like green things were coming out of their ear. You're not gonna turn into a watermelon. If they eat the seed. Mm-hmm. But what if it goes down my body? That's fine. There's seeds on watermelon, are on strawberries, and you eat strawberries. There's a whole bunch of tiny little baby seeds. Here, you want another piece? I love fruit in the summertime. Ezzy, no. No. Ezzy's in his favorite spot under the sink. Ezzy, no. Mama Tay, no. He's like, I don't care. I wonder what it is about kids and getting under the sink and playing with bowls and pans and stuff. I feel like almost every kid does that. You, Layla, did it too. You know? Now he gave me something else to clean up. Do you hear him? Like, he's legit taking everything out from under the cover. Cutting up the chicken. 
I love like the leg part of a rotisserie chicken. I love the leg part on uh, like wings too. Man, putting butter on this before I put it in the oven to warm it up. Yeah. It made it like super juicy. Super, super juicy. I don't think there's gonna be much chicken left on here. Might be enough for like one or two wraps sometime this week. Tomorrow I'm gonna make a roast with potatoes. Layla doesn't eat that, so maybe she'll eat some leftover chicken. Or I got like french fries and chicken nuggets and hot dogs and like all that kid stuff in the freezer. If she wants that instead. Mister. You wanna eat? Let me serve these kids so I can sit down and eat. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Are you gonna eat? Mama gave you a little bit of rice and a little bit of green beans and a tiny little piece of chicken. You gonna eat some chicken? You can eat some chicken? Maybe I'll put a little bit more on your plate. No, maybe I won't. He's got some um, Gerber oatmeal that he ate a little bit of yesterday. So he, if he doesn't eat what I put on his plate now, he can eat the rest of that. All right, so mama's plate, sissy's plate, Ezzy's plate. We about to eat dinner. Ezra James, look what he did. Dude, if you didn't want it, you didn't have to throw it. He's literally sitting here crying because he didn't want the food. I tried feeding it to him. So then I left the plate by him and walked out to the kitchen. He legit threw it on the floor. Oh. First time he's ever done that. You want me to help you? There. Thank you. Here. Eat. Eat. You want to do it yourself? Here. Here. Yeah. Azri. Sit. And eat. Here. Here. I know you got to be hungry. Here. <laughs> Esri! <laughs> Look, eat! Mm. Leave him alone. I want to see what he does. I'm going to knock, knock it on the floor again. I'm going to clean that up. He might taste it. Oh, did you hear me talking? All right, I'll go in the kitchen. Leave him alone. Try it, 
Try it. This is why people think that I'm starving you and I don't feed you. Because you don't want nothing. You legit don't like to eat nothing. Now watch this. Goldfish. I bet you he picks these up and eat them. Look. Yep. Told you. So we're done eating. As he threw his food on the floor again, I gotta clean it up. <sighs> See it over there? He legit threw it on the floor again. But we just got off the phone with my mom. She called, talked to the kids. This house is like making my brain hurt but we need to go to bed because it is 8 30 and i gotta get up at four so i hate when you have like a plan to like do so much stuff and then you just don't do it if we wouldn't have spent three hours outside today but it's all right the kids needed to get out so <sighs> tomorrow's a long work day Come on, iPad off. You, Layla, what did I say? Izzy, you're showing everybody my boobies. No. No. Uh, it's time for bed. He's tired. I'm tired. We're all tired. What is on my shirt? He must have bit me when I was holding him. I don't even know why mama even bothers putting these blinds down because you didn't ripped half of them off already. Look. I swear. I need to measure that blind so I can get some more. Look at my blinds. From this child. Yeah, you. <laughs> Little blind breaker. <laughs> All right, time to go upstairs. Okay, I'm looking for the office. Oh my God, you can't even walk in here. It's so messy. I wish I didn't work tomorrow so I could stay home and clean. Wish I could stay up later and clean while the kids are in bed, but I can't. I need to get I need to get sleep. Or I'm not gonna be able to function well. You know how to press the off button. Quit playing me. No, 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 no. Come on. I let you play outside for a long time today. It's time to go to bed. I could have been cleaning this house. It's 9.05. The kids are upstairs in bed. The last, like, four days, I think it's been four days, three or four days, I have been taking the kids upstairs, laying them down, and letting them fall asleep without me. Trying to get them used to going to bed without me. Problem is, they're gonna get used to going to sleep with each other, but I like them going to bed a little bit earlier than me. So that way I can like clean up, watch a little bit of TV, you know what I mean? Like have some me time before I go to bed, which isn't happening tonight though, by the way. <laughs> but it did yesterday and the night before that. Today, I don't know, I think because we were outside for a really long time today, it kind of threw off the day and like the routine. So, plus I went to Walmart and I was there like all morning. So that kind of threw stuff off too. I could have been like doing housework in the morning when the kids were at daycare, but I ruined that by going shopping. That's why I like doing the Walmart um, pickup or delivery because I don't have to waste hours 
in Walmart and I don't have to like buy more than what I want to buy if I just do the Walmart pickup. Like <laughs> I bought way more today than I probably would have if I just would have did like a Walmart pickup thing or delivery. Um, I'm about to go to bed though. So thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you in the next vlog, not tomorrow though, long work day tomorrow. And I'm overwhelmed. My brain is overwhelmed. I don't know what is wrong with me. Is there a medical condition for when like everything around you is a mess and it messes with your brain and overwhelms you? Like, is that, what is that? Because whatever that is, I have it. Like, I'm looking around right now and I want to stay up and clean, but I know I can't because I have to get up at 4 o'clock in the morning. So, I'm going to go to bed. And when I wake up in the morning and I come downstairs and make my coffee, it's going to make me sad because the house is a mess. And I'm going to want to clean, but I'm not going to have the time to do it. Then I'm going to be at work all day tomorrow thinking about it. Thinking about what a mess I have to clean when I get home. There's something seriously wrong with me. Anywho, I wish this house would clean itself while I went to bed tonight. But that's not going to happen. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Peace.